welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am joined by Blondie herself. She's actually sitting on my laptop. I'm gonna face the camera. <laughs> Diva. Today is D-Day. It's delivery day of my sofas. If you checked my last video that I did, I am currently working with DFS. So you might have seen my last video. I will pop a link to it below. Basically, I went sofa shopping um, because I've never had like a new piece of furniture in the house because obviously everything is, you know, second hand and upcycled and recycled. But unfortunately, my second hand couches have served me well. I've gotten a good five years out of them and I think it was time to get something that like better worked with the room. So I was delighted when DFS asked if I wanted to kind of team up. So today is delivery day. So me and Blondie are sitting in the kitchen because we ain't got no sofas to sit on. <laughs> so our sofas are due to arrive around three o'clock. So I have been cleaning the living room. I call it a sitting room. <laughs> we have been cleaning and mopping floors and getting rid of our old sofas. They've gone off to their new home. So I'm gonna show you the living room before and I'm gonna hopefully film the guys um, setting them up. Uh, for me in the house because I cannot lift no sofas. So that's one of the perks is um, Lisa, you remember in the last video, she was telling me the guys will do everything. So they literally come in, unwrap it, take all of the rubbish, um, everything from like the cushions and everything, they will assemble the whole thing for me. Come with me and I will show you the living room now while it's nice and empty. So here is, now the living room is really echoey. It's amazing what furniture can do. It's like it absorbs all the sound. So. Here is where the two-seater pink sofa is gonna sit. And then over here, just by the china cabinet. So in this space, the little love seat is gonna go. It's actually called the cuddler. Um, you'll see it when the guys set it up. I keep calling it a love seat, but it's a cuddler that's gonna go here. So this is the room kind of before. Um, you'll remember these from last week's video, my little pumpkins. And then I just have a pile of cushions from my old sofas. Oh, and my slippers. God. I can't believe I don't have my slippers on. So weird. It feels like moving in, if that makes sense. Anyone who's like, maybe you rent or you've gone to a new space or you've moved house and when you walk in and everything is just echoey. Um, it has that, like it doesn't feel like my home. Um, I'm like, get the couches in so I can like, make it cozy. It just feels weird. Good weird though. Um, so oh, I'm excited now for them to come. I also hope I measured correctly. I'm having doubts. I measured off the old ones and they were smaller, which is what I wanted. I hope when they come now they fit. They should fit. I followed all the instructions on the website. I measured um, how we talked about in the video, the last video. I'm just having them last minute nails that I'm like, oh God, what if they fit? Um, or don't fit. So, light a candle leaf fit, lads. <laughs> and I haven't made a mistake. <laughs> now that I'm like, the room is empty, I feel like I could 110% get some more like shelving in. Obviously not here, but I reckon I should make that bigger. And see this wall over here. So, this wall, I could totally do a feature or something. Yeah. So that is the room all empty. It's amazing what furniture can do. So a love seat, a pink seat and a footstool. Sofas are in. Blondie is just testing out her new footstool. The lighting has gone kind of bad. It looks like it's gone around. It's literally just gone grey. So I'm going to wait to show you around when the lighting gets a little bit better. Um, and I'm going to enjoy my sofas. Had our sofas in Blondie in like two minutes. 
and I'm sure you will agree they were very easy on the eye. <laughs> so that was a treat, Blondie. Two handsome men in the living room on a tourist day. <laughs> I'm gonna have fun just playing around with styling these and making them cozy. Yeah, I think I'm gonna, I'll wait till the lighting gets better and then I'll film us. It matches Blondie's color actually. The new pink couch matches her, her color. <laughs> I love that I have more space in this room so before the last couch went to the door and the door there so it was completely taken over by a couch. Same with over here like I have space here now. I also have lots of space here. Um, I might move the sofa up a tiny bit but this was like tight to the lamp the last one and to the light switch so these just fit the space so much better so I'm loving the extra bit of space and also they're higher off the ground so it makes things look like makes the room look bigger because they're high off the ground I actually really like the floral fabric and um, if you saw my last video you'll know that you can flip these and have these plain if you want to but I'm going to leave the floral out on mine for now. The footstool when I lift it, I won't lift it because Blondie's on it, also has floral underneath but I'll show you that. And then here is my pink one. I'm after being sitting down so I haven't styled it yet with the cushions but um, I went for the velvet as well so it is super soft and squishy. I have the, I think it's microfiber filling or the fiber filled filling but it's basically really squishy. So yeah I'm gonna have fun playing around with these. Um, I'm up early today because I'm actually going Christmas shopping with Karen which will be another video um, but I just thought I would show you quickly the room when the lighting was a bit better because it was so rainy the other day and it's nice and sunny this morning. So I have these sofas now a couple of days so it's now Sunday, I think I started filming on Thursday and I haven't got my bum off them. <laughs> Blondie and Pepsi, well Pepsi was never an issue, Blondie liked to scratch my old ones but for any cat people, a little video I watched which was great was Jackson Galaxy. If you just search like Jackson Galaxy sofa scratching, really good video. I didn't have to get the sticky paws. Um, I just put extra scratching posts beside the sofas. So where she would scratch, I have replaced with a scratching post. And um, I close the living room door when I'm not in work. So the girls are not allowed in the living room when I am in work or at night time. Um, but don't worry, they still have the rest of the house. Um, but just until I can get Blondie to a stage where she stops going near them. She's been really good though, you can tell she knows. She knows. <laughs> also, another thing I've had to do with the sofas is when I'm going to bed and I'm finished like lounging on the sofas, I just plump them back up because I have the um, fibre filled and um, so they're extra squishy and soft. So what I do is I just take them off before I go to bed, give them a plump and put the sofa back together so it looks really cute. I'm so glad I got a footstool because I love a cheeky 20 minute nap when I come home from work and the footstool is a game changer for that. I can like lay flat <laughs> and I'm, I'm like super cozy. <laughs> so guys I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Please if you are looking to buy a sofa 
I made a video with DFS a couple of weeks ago where we went through the whole steps involved in buying a sofa because I had never bought a piece of furniture this big. So I didn't want to make a mistake. I didn't want to buy something the wrong size because like sofas, I think they're one of the most expensive pieces of furniture you will buy for your home. So you don't want to make a mistake and you want to get the perfect size. So um, I just spoke with Lisa in DFS. So you can check out that video. We went through everywhere from where to start to sizing, measuring, fabric bricks the whole lot we went through it all I've also put more pictures of my sofas in my living room over on the blog I've also linked to them as well in the blog post if you head to my website give this video a thumbs up let me know what do you prefer do you prefer it floral or do you prefer it plain because technically I kind of got four sofas because you can change them twice which is amazing I love that option <laughs> Thanks so much for watching and I will see you all in next week's video and you can also catch me on Instagram during the week as well. Talk to you later. Bye.